and it's that time of the month again favorites video there's a little bit of a different background because we put our tree up in our living room starting with a new game that my sister taught me how to play called Catan. it's freaking awesome um basically you're trying to build a road and a settlement which, if you've never played, it makes no sense. But I don't know. If you've never played, you should buy it or find somebody that owns it and try and play at least one time. Because it kind of becomes addictive. Ooh, where'd they go? This month, me and this, yeah, this, my doll, became best friends over the month. Dude, I had a really rough period this last time. I know, TMI, but she became my friend. This is a little owl. It's one of those, like, rice bags. You heat up in the microwave and you stick it on your ovaries because there you feel like they're exploding. Yep, she's awesome. She's like a little miniature heating pad and she kind of weighs a little bit so it's like pressure. It's awesome. My sister got this years ago and she got herself a newer one so she gave me this one. And I love it to death. It smells like lavender. Not as much as it used to, but it still kind of does. Something that I have been looking for for years. Years, 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 years. We've looked everywhere for years. And guess what? Last week at Walmart, which is having even more numbers here still on, for $3.78, I found green leggings. Yes, I did. Pretty sure I've never been prouder of myself. What are these? They're Sperry's, which were popular like, I don't know, what was that, 2011? Oh, there's something on it. Anyways, they were popular forever ago. I just really got back into them. Um, I wear them all the time unless it's raining because it'll stain them. Cute, I love them. A Christmas hat. It has a bell on it. I'm not actually going to put it on, but I will show you what it would look like if on. Ta-da! I wear it to work every night because uh, we're kind of required to. Work gave it to me, but it's like my favorite thing in the world. Because that just means Christmas is getting closer. My friends Ryan and Ashley, after trying for 11 years, are finally pregnant. Um, that's exciting. Connor Franta has clothes that are going to be featured in Urban Outfitters starting the 29th. It's going to be in eight Urban Outfitters stores. Could eventually be nationwide. So, like, my little baby is, like, venturing out into the real world, so that's cool. Um, if you weren't watching the AMAs, where were you? The show was awesome, but Niall and, um, James Bay's performances were the best. They were stripped down, they were raw, they were proof that all you need is, like, a guitar and your voice and a little bit of music to make something fantastic. It was awesome. Niall and Shawn Mendes, there's like a minute video going around the internet where they were like singing Mercy. So like if you've not seen that, I promise you it's like a collaboration you've been waiting for. <laughs> Gigi Hadid was super funny all night. Like I found this that says she's amazing because she kind of was. <laughs> Um, I didn't realize she was that funny, and dude, that red dress she had on looked beautiful on her, but that sparkly, like, tracksuit, jumpsuit thing she wore at the end may have been the greatest thing to ever exist. Zayn freaking won his award, and he stood up there and said, does this one even, this one only has my name on it, right? Which was like, ha 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 cute, but also savage, because Niall was in the audience, and speaking of that, when Niall walked by him, he, he shook his hand and said hi, and Zane said hi to him. Like, you could tell Zane was probably going to ignore him, but yeah. I just watched Dancing with the Stars finale last night, and their, like, thing that was sponsored by Macy's that they did, where they made it look like you were in the TV, and then you were on stage, and you were in the TV, and you were on stage. I don't know how they did it, but it was freaking cool. Um, and Lily Sings put out the most savage video the other day. It was How to Make a Sandwich. If you've not watched that, trust me, you are missing out on the savageness of Lily Singh. 
Oh my god, it was my favorite thing in the entire universe. Favorites from the month of November. Down in the comments below, let me know what your month of November favorites were. And on that note, ladies and gentlemen, I, oh, give the video a ray. Going to go with you.